That means I'm gonna have to change my uh, my audio so that I can hear. I might have to grab my headphones. If we die, please bear with me as I switch headphones and restart my audio itself. So please understand that may happen in the very near future. So some of this fur has some nice big cracks and splits in it. So I filled it with some CA to get ourselves nice and, uh, nice and clean and, and uh, solid, a little bit more solid. There we go. Somewhat apologize. I do have noise filters, but for some reason, they're not working quite like they used to. So you get a little bit more ASMR shop sounds here than you used to get. Some people like it, some people don't. If you don't care for it, I apologize. If you like it, all the better. I think this is the last one with CA on it, so I think we should be good after this. This one is just going to take the longest because of that CA. Yeah, this one was one that really split wide open. There you go. Huntress, that's a, uh, a very good uh, suggestion. If you don't like the shop ASMR, you can mute the screen and turn on the closed captioning and see how well the Twitch closed captioning actually grits. Uh, well, actually, you probably won't be able to see how well. You just could be amused at uh, what comes through on closed captioning. Needless to say, it's pretty terrible. knock our edges down. Well, and you know what, Huntress? That makes it all the better. There we go. Alright. Time to knock our corners. So yes, we'll uh, we'll finish up these blocks. We've got some round blocks, round pieces too. And we'll apply some finish tonight. That'll be fun. That'll leave Saturday. We'll sand and finish this. We'll make our shellac and apply that to our wagon. Pose this question to chat with new folks that are hanging out. That was a very good question.
What is your least favorite word? I still haven't figured mine out yet. What is your least favorite word? And I guess my, if I remember correctly, Hunter said for the general population, that word is moist. For the overwhelming amount of population, that word is moist. Absolutely, Huntress. I try to make that happen. figured out what my least favorite word is. Shanigan shared the word hate as being his least favorite word. And probably because it's it's overused and misused by most people. Because hate is a very, very strong term. And I agree with him. Hate is a very, very strong term, and I think most people use that. Just like they use the term love. There you go. Yep, Hunter says was no with, with absolutely no thought or consideration, just a, an immediate no. I mean, there's plenty of words out there, and I'm sure that we all have some, some that stand out to us. Let's do the big, uh, big rectangles. Oh, we do have some more TA. Oh, yeah, we had a lot of TA. out there that I'm sure we're not thinking of. Observe a mama bird, that'll take me to the next point of people not being able to admit when they're wrong. Not really related to our topic, related to the topic, but something that does annoy me. No, not, not, not being able to admit. You know what? I'm sorry. I was wrong. And I'll tell you something that was very interesting too. When we had our exchange sheet, I think I've shared this story before, but he made the comment because he went to the grocery store one time with my wife and, and noticed that, you know, if you got bumped into or into or somebody bumped into you, somebody said, oh, excuse me, sorry, right? Just out of courtesy, just, oh, you know, part didn't mean to bump into you, that type of thing. But he said, in Germany, that doesn't happen. It's a matter of, hey, just get out of my way. Which I thought was very interesting. But yeah, the fake sorry. Yeah. That's a good one. 